Now we're going to look at ordering decimals. So here's a typical question. It says order these numbers from smallest to largest and it has given us some decimal numbers to arrange in order from smallest to largest. Now, decimal numbers are quite um, a bit more tricky to organise or order than uh, normal numbers. The reason is um, is really the length of the decimal numbers. As you can see here, some of them have got um, units, tenths, hundredths and thousandths, where some have just got units and tenths. And the fact that they are not all the same length as each other makes it more difficult to organise. So what we're going to do is we're going to make, I recommend, uh, making all the numbers the same length. So the longest one has got three decimal places, so three numbers after the decimal point. Um, this one has got three, this one's got three, this one's got three, this one's got two, so we're going to put a zero on the end of this one to make it the same length as the others. And this one's only got one decimal place, so we're going to put two zeros on the end of it. Now we can arrange them in order uh, much more easily than we could have done at the beginning. Here you can see this one is 3 3.0002, 3.101, 3.111, 3.013, 3.010, and 3.200. So to find the smallest one, look and see which one has got the smallest number after the decimal point. Well, that's going to be this one. This one's clearly the smallest. You can see that it's got 0, 0, 002, 0, 010. 0. Yeah. Okay. The next smallest would then be this one, zero, uh, 3.010, it would be the next smallest. The next smallest would be 3.013, let's see, then it would be 3.100, sorry, 3.101, um, and then 3.111, and finally 3.0. Two zero zero. So here we've arranged them from smallest to largest. What I would strongly recommend is that whenever you order these, you make them the same length by adding zeros on to the end of the numbers.